Hi family, so I was thinking about this today and I'm curious to know you guys' perspective. So, a uh, quick background. Mom is from Guyana. Some of her family is were indentured servants, came over from India. The other part were Africans, okay? Then we have dad. Dad is Jamaican. Um, his mother, her mom was the daughter of an African slave and then his um, grandfather was a Cuban man who came over during the time of Castro. He had tobacco farm in Jamaica, still there to this day, whatever. But my dad's father is actually, or rested dead, he, um, he was actually the son of colonizers, right? So growing up in Jamaica, I did not really understand um, like necessarily division because for me, my cousins were white my cousins were black my cousins were chinese my cousins were indian my cousins were i didn't to me they were all the same it was like we are all a family because we're all jamaican it wasn't a thing of like division it wasn't until i got to maybe high school and then especially when i got to college when people would say wow what are you 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 got good hair and this and i'm like what the hell is that what does that what does that mean what is that and I genuinely did not understand because I didn't, in my family, like I said, I have people of all different races, all different shades, all like, you know, so all different hair textures, all different skin textures. Like it wasn't really a thing um, until it was pointed out to me by people here in America. So long story short, um, when I went to college, it was very embarrassing I felt like because I when people would ask me like oh do you consider yourself black I would say well do you mean african-american and they would say yes and I would say no because I'm not no I'm not in that case I'm not black and before anybody gets crazy on me listen here this is my experience this is me just talking about how I the growth that I've had as a person and the growth that I've had as I've become educated about things is now I understand that yes, in fact, I am black. But back then, I didn't identify because I thought black meant Afri African American. And I'm the first generation to be born in America. I have no ties to any, any African American history here in America. Now I know, yes, all of our ancestors were connected. Some of us just got dropped off from other places, but we were all connected. But I'm curious to hear you guys' perspective as Caribbeans. What is your perspective and how do you identify? What you mix with though? You mix with something? What's your, uh, what are you? You know what? That's funny. I, I, I feel it's weird when people say what you mix with because I feel like not enough people rep for being black. Um, you got the hair thing no, going on, my, my, you got cheeky eyes. Daddy, Look like my, you got Chinese on the arm, like. My, my daddy is half Indian and my father's side is mixed with a lot of Asian. If you want some, if you want some Chinese in you, my daddy could give you some cock. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Bangkok. Um, so, you know, I mean, you know, but shout out to, shout out to my black sisters because I don't think we're, we're proud of who we are enough and and so I, I always want to put that out there okay, Nikki, it, yes. every time I see you